Tell a friend and tell a friend that do it all all is in. And we're back with another NBA 2K25 next year NBA video. And today I have a crazy lockdown. And I do mean crazy, man. I wanted this build to have 99 perimeter and 99 steel. But I'm letting you know right now that you need your plus 5, which I have my plus 5 already, to get both categories to a 99. That's perimeter defense and steel. Okay, but I'm going to give you one out the gate, and then once you get your plus five, you can get the other one, and the build will be complete at that point. But the build is crazy, okay? So just think about it. You're going to have 99 to two categories, so you have to make some sacrifices, but you still can go out there and do what you need to do when it comes to finishing, when it comes to shooting, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. As you can see, shooting guard position, six foot four, six foot four, the infamous six foot four height is super crazy and you know creating a build at another height i wouldn't get any of this stuff like that and that's why i do a lot of six four builds 235 so you're gonna be a, uh, not you're not short in real life but short on the game a little short um stocky um lockdown you know what i'm saying uh seven foot wingspan that's maxed out wingspan so you got long arms on this build um you're gonna get a lot of steals you're gonna get a lot of deflections okay so let's get into it right we're gonna start with the finishing so the finishing on the bill is like okay you know what i'm saying nothing special about it um you just want to be able to cut to the basket and be able to dunk once you catch the ball so i added a little bit of standard dunk i really would like to get that up to a 65 but you know we had to do what we had to do right for the driving dunk we're going to get that to a 73 and you have to be careful on what you take up because you can easily mess something up with this build and i tried to get everything i can out of the bill um and don't leave anything on the table for what i wanted to do with the bill uh, because i'm sure somebody out there would like a bill like this um even though they may not see it but they're gonna like it all right as far as the driving layup it's going to go up to a 60 uh the close shot at a 58 um the post control is going to go up to a 42 because we have a lot of strength on the build and i'll show you that here in a second so the finishing nothing special i know you 6'4 you want to be able to do a little bit more with the finishing but it's fine okay because you're out there to play defense you're locked down a real super locked down okay now let's go down to the physicals now we're going to take the agility to a 90. i want the agility at a 92 but I couldn't get it to a 92 because of what we have on the strength, which I'm about to show you. Um, but the speed, you can leave it at an 80 or you can take it to an 85 like I did. I took it to an 85. But you can leave it at an 80 if you want to. It's totally up to you. Um, we got the 90 agility, like I said. Um, we also have a 92 strength on this build, okay? 92 strength. All right, that does allow us to get um, immovable enforcer on legend. Okay, that badge will be on legend. But you have to get your perimeter defense up to a certain number for you to get it on legend. But as of now, um, we're going to have that badge on legend, right? With the vertical, I just took the vertical up to a 69. Um, I wanted it a little bit higher for the shot blocking because I have a 6'4 build um, with a 70 shot blocking and like a 67 vertical. And he really don't be blocking shots like my uh, point guard that has a 68 block and a 75 vertical. So I noticed the difference in the vertical. So the vertical does help with the block. So you may want to take this up if you can. Um, if you're willing to sacrifice the speed and take that down to 80, I will put something on the vertical so you can get up and block some shots. But as of now, I did give the build a 69 block. I think that should be okay. You should be able to get some blocks with that, right? So that's what we have for the finishing. That's what we have for the physical. So let's go ahead and get it to the green bean. Make your girl scream badge. This build does have an 83 three-point shot, right? You can take that up. You can take it down. It's totally up to you. But we wanted to at least have that limitless range on bronze. We wanted that set shot specialist on silver with this build. And we don't have any mid-range shooting. Not like high mid-range shooting. But you still should be able to make some mid-range shots. And we have a 60 on the free throw. So um, the shooting is not all that bad. You know, you have to think about it. This build does have a 99 category at the gate. Um, it's something you don't have to wait on. So, you know, that does take a lot away from the build. Anytime you do a 99, anything on the build is going to take away a lot. And, you know, you're going to be missing something, you know. But I'm not, no, I'm not going to say you're going to be missing something. You're just going to have a low category you know now low category is probably playmaking and finishing okay so uh, that's what we have for the shooting but let's go ahead and get into the sauce but before we do 
I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama can see this video. And I need everybody mama to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. Pass accuracy, we only got that to a 71, which I think is decent. Um, you know, you can make some okay passes with that. You get silver diamonds, you get break start on this build, even though we're not um, out there trying to get rebounds with this build. But we do have that uh, dimer. When I first created the build, I wanted a little bit more passing, maybe a 75 or at least a 78. Um, but, you know, I couldn't get it. Um, and the ball handle, same thing. I wanted to get this up a little bit higher, but we was able to get it to a 75. So you can at least put the ball on the floor. And uh, speed with ball is a 70. So you still will be able to put the ball on the floor, you know, one or two dribbles and get to the rim or whatever. Uh, you got that strong handles on gold. Um, you have anchor assassin on bronze, handle for days on bronze, and unpluckable on bronze. So, you know, you can move around a little bit. You just don't have to sit in a corner or whatever and wait on somebody to tell you to cut. You can, you know, do one or two moves here and there. Okay, now let's get to the most important part of the bill, which is the defense, right? So, like I said, we do have a 99 category at the gate which is the steal so we took the steal to 99 um everybody know that intercept is like overpowered this year and on my new point guard i was able to get my steal to 99 with the plus five so i'm testing that out i don't have those badges on legend yet so you know i, I can't really say uh how i feel about legend badges on the steal um but right now i think i got hall of fame interceptor and i don't even think i got hall of fame glove yeah i think i got gold but they go to the legend okay as far as the perimeter defense, we're going to get that up to a 94, okay? A 94 perimeter defense, it does give us uh, immovable enforcer on legend. As you can see, we got all ball piss on Hall of Fame. Um, it's going to go to uh, legend once we get the perimeter defense to a 99 with that plus 5. With pick dodge, now we can't get this on legend because we don't have enough agility. And the reason we don't have enough agility is because we wanted more strength on the bill. Okay, so pick dodge still will be on Hall of Fame, okay, because we're going to have a um, 97 uh, perimeter and an 85 agility. So we still will get that badge on Hall of Fame. So that's not too bad. On ball minutes, once we get the perimeter defense to a 99, all you need is... Um, I can't I can't remember what you what you need, but uh you're gonna have it. I think you need an 89 uh, agility and like a 99 uh, perimeter or something like that. But anyway, you're gonna have um, on ball minutes and you're gonna have challenger. Both of those will be on legend once you add the plus five. Okay, so make sure you add the plus five with the shot blocker. We're gonna get that up to a 68. We still can block some shots. You know, not saying that a super high clip. But you know we can, okay? And put the rest on the uh, rebound. So that's this build right here, man. Um, you know, change what you want to change. I just wanted to make a crazy build, but let's get to the shades of here we go, here we go, here we go now. Alex Caruso, Doug Christie, and Herbert Jones. And the build is the infamous three and D, that boy, that boy Stock ain't three and D two guard. <laughs> that's the build I'm out of here. Ciao!